What is up, Flock? Things over here. Welcome back to another Farming Sim 22 Mod Spotlight. This is where we check out some cool mods like you guys, my thoughts and opinions, and I'll leave them link down in the description down below so you can go download them if you are interested. Now today we're going to be checking out everything from last week that we didn't get to check out from last week because um, I moved yesterday, so I had to like uh, just get as much as possible. So this is actually a week behind. So something cooler could have come out between now and then, but. Uh, you guys will see that next week. Anywho, anywho, let's go ahead and jump into it. Uh, so we have this Cali hauling pack, I guess it's called. I, I'm not quite sure how this works, but we're going to figure it out. I don't know if I've done this Freightliner yet. I, I I, would think we did, but we're going to do it again anyway, because I, I truly don't remember. I'm sorry, does that say P on Peter? But it does. All right. We have this Ford I don't think we've covered. We have a Go-Kart, and then we have a Ram Promaster. Um, but we're going to jump in what's going to take us the longest, which is the Cali Pack. So, let's go ahead and hop in our truck here. Right. Let's go ahead and customize this. So, we have a single steel cover. We're going to, because the, the Cali Pack is supposed to be like short. So, we're going to stick with the single, or sing, single rear axle. So I think I like that best. We're gonna stick with that stock plastic bumper. No, we want, yeah, we want that Texas Chrome bumper. Yeah, there we go. Oh, and we can get with lights. Sign me up, chicken lights. You guys know I'm all about the lights. Fenders, quarter fenders. Can we get? Um. Yeah, let's do those. That looks cool. Side boxes, none. Protect. I don't think we have enough space for those. Skins. CF. No, we're not going to do that. We'll do that. I like that. What's? Yeah, no, we're going to do that. Racks. <laughs> do you put a rack on? You know what? Let's do. Let's do this rack here. Yeah. Stock exhaust. Dual straight pipe single. Dual stock. Let's do dual stock. I like the heat guards. Fairing. Yeah, we'll do the fairing. And roof. Nah, we won't do the roof cap. We'll do the fairing, so. Visors. I'll do the drop visor with the lights because yellow. Uh, no GPS. Main color. Oh, I like that. Yeah, we'll do that. Customize. Alright, so here we go. This is our. Truck. Again, I can't remember if I've done this or not. Oh, all the lights on. <gasps> that cab rocks back and forth. I am sorry. Unfold truck. What's this do? That must be for like a triax or something. This is actually, it does. Can we? Oh no! Skirt! What are those? Nice. Alright. Let's go ahead and put that back down. Horn. Okay, that's better than better than the Max and Volvo last time. Alright. So I'm not quite sure how this is supposed to go. I guess we'll do it like this. What's the difference between these? Ranco, Ranco, belly dump, front belly. Okay, so I guess this is the front, and this. Okay, yeah, it does say back. Oh, look at me. So this was the front, right? I guess it'll tell us when we hook up to it, right? Front, yes. And then we. I guess we need to. Dolly here. We are hitting that so hard. That's hooked up. Don't mind the Discord notifications currently. Just make this easy peasy on ourselves because I won't be able to back that sucker up. There we go. 
Dude, this is a bad little setup right here, isn't it? Dang. Go ahead and customize this. Uh, let's start with the back. Customize. Wheels up standard. Super single. No. I want standard. Uh, can we make them? Uh, I don't know what to make. I guess we'll make them black. Okay. Customize. We'll do this. Do the same. I kind of wish it changed the fender colors too. Does it see the room? No, it doesn't. Keep that chrome. Customize, yes. And then we'll do the front. I just like screw up here. There we go. Alright, let's fill these suckers up. What do we want to fill it with? We'll do stones. That makes sense, right? There we go. Not, not digging this interior color. Oh my god. Did we get up to 93? I don't know if we're going to get the 93 boys. I don't think this thing likes this tra these trailers. To be fair, I think it is a lot of weight on it. Let's go ahead and uh, we'll buy another trailer for this thing and we'll test it with another one after these. You know, let's just do a default load king. Yep. And we'll, we'll put uh, another axle on this thing. Do the lights in these trailers work? I like the sound effect. Did 
That's really cool. Alright. Go ahead and drop that. Customize. Oh, you can make this a flatbed? That's cool. This works. I don't need nothing fancy. Okay, unfold is for the. Try Axel. Oh, we're going faster than we were with the Melody Two trailers. I don't, know, I don't think we're gonna hit 93. I mean, we're still going up. We haven't like topped out yet. Okay, we managed to get 68 with a trailer. What can we get up to without a trailer? Oh, 70? 71? So the truck, I'll give it 5 out of 5. It does look really, really good. I, ha I don't have any complaints other than the interior color. Um, it does not... I, I, I'm going to go out on a wild limb and say it does actually reach its top speed of 90-something. Because um, we we never, like, got anywhere to where it stops. It, I thought it was going to for sure stop at, like, 70-something, but it kept going up. So, um, I'll give it 5 out of 5. I like the realism. I like... You know, it doesn't just like shoot off, take off like a rocket. Um, and it takes a while to build that speed. I mean, that's legit. It did have some problems with these trailers, but I think that was just because it was under a load. So uh, the trailers kind of sit also, if you notice, kind of low. So that could be the issue. Uh, we're not done with the trailers because the trailers include these, uh, these beds here. So we're going to check that out as well. But we're going to hop in the Ford first. This thing... Feels kind of big. Let's find another Ford to just compare the size. Because that Ram might be on the smaller side. Um, this is a good comparison. Okay, no. It's correct. Alright. That Ram just might be a little small. How can we do this thing? Customize. Wheels up, steel wheels. Steel wheels 2. I think I would like steel wheels 2 a lot better. Yep. Black plastic. I kind of wish they had like a chrome option though. Black plastic with chrome insert. Chrome grill with black insert. I like the, that. Yeah. We're going to go with that. Uh, bed steel. Aluminum. 
do the aluminum. Aluminum. Oh, we can make it purple. Is there a cooler purple? Yeah. Shadow violet. I like it. All right. We have... Oh, they have the freaking light bulb lights. There's no back blinkers on this thing. We have reverse lights and brake lights, though. Okay, can I attach this thing? Alright, so you have this bed here and... This bed over here, I'm not quite sure what the difference is. But I think I like this bed over here a little bit more, so we're, we're going to try this one. Front transfer box. Okay. This is back transfer box. Rogue transfer tub. I don't know the difference. I, I don't... I'm not even going to pretend to know the difference. What? Hello? What's... What is I think it's called the Cali Pack. We're going to check out real quick. Let's balk. Yeah, okay. Cali Pack. Just going to scroll down here so we can find it. Cali pack, Cali pack, Cali pack, Cali pack. All right, so it comes with the front AR box, transfer pup, transfer tub. I don't know what it's supposed to go to unless it's. Okay, can we pick up the other one? Okay, we can pick this one up, so we're gonna go with this one. I uh I don't know what's going on with the other one. It's kinda just stuck in the ground. Oh we have a we have a runaway trailer. Runaway trailer. Just trying to go. Is that on there or what's going on here? Okay, if you unfold it, it connects. Okay, what can we do to the transfer? Okay, we can change this color. I think these trailers might be a little heavy. Okay, 
The Cali pack, we'll give it four out of five. We'll give it four out of five because that one's kind of stuck in there. And I feel like the trailers are might be a little bit heavy. Uh, and this one doesn't really have any any break. It just rolls away. So we'll give it four out of five. It's just got some minor things. Um, I, I need a... I need a... This works. Just want to see if the gooseneck works on this thing. And can we give it like a bail? Yeah. There we go. Just a, just a little widow one. There we go. Straps work. Interior look like not bad, not bad at all. It might, it might help just a little bit if I actually lined it up, right? There we go. It works. All right. Horn. Really weak horn. All right. So, the Ford, I'll give it four out of five as well. Uh, I do like all the options for like the wheels and stuff. I just wish they would give us like chrome wheels. Uh, I mean, they make it so you can do the chrome grill. Uh, I wish you could have like chrome rims. Chrome whims? What the world? Chrome rims as well. I think that would add to it. Um, that and there's no turn signals on the back of this thing. Look at all these lights with no turn signals. Like, here, yeah, they're on. I'm not seeing. I see them on the front and on the grill. None back here. Oh, and it's got the the just where the bulb lights up for the headlights. I hate that. So, four out of five for that. And let's move on to the next mod, which is gonna be our little doom buggy here. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> I love how there's like a starting animation. Your guy actually. Gets in and starts the engine. That's cool. Alright. What can we do with this thing? Wheel setup. Midas. Oh, why would you want those? Continental. PK. Nokian. We're going to do the Midas. Wheel setup. Rim 1. Rim 2. Rim 3. Rim 4. Rim 5. I think Rim 1 probably the best. Side protection. Standard. Engine protection. Engine and head protection. Oh. from the, Okay. Yeah. We'll do that. Side protection. Can we just get like complete protection? I guess this is a complete. All right, we'll do that. Protection of the chassis, no. Metallic side colored bumper. We want this to be safe, so yeah, give me all the protection. Camouflage standard. One, two, three. Yeah, I think we're. Is that Dalmatian? Okay. You know, give me the Dalmatian. Yeah, I want to hide in with the cows. Spoiler. <laughs> yes, please. I want carbon fiber, exhaust, metallic, black. Let's make it metallic. Numbers. Oh, I can, oh, we only go up to nine. All right, we'll put number eight on it. Lighthouse. Headlight. Yeah, let's do both. We want, I just want this to look ridiculous. Sticker one. Sticker two, sticker three. Oh, let's do sticker four. I like that. Attachers. We can put a rear hitch on. Rear hitch and... Front and rear. How does the winch work? Yeah, rear hitch and front front winch, winch is what we'll do. Steering wheel design one, design two. Let's do two. Body work. Let's just make that black chrome. Yeah. Protection arcs. Let's make that black chrome too. Yeah. 
see. Make that white to match that suspension. Black chrome, yep. Rim color, black chrome. Yeah, customize. Yep. Love it. It has brake lights. Okay. All the lights. Yep. I'm not quite sure what this does. Not seeing it change anything. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Now what's this do? Oh, it lowers it even further in the back. All right. Can we just jack that all the way up. There we go. I don't know what this does though. Does the winch actually work? Yeah, buddy. Do I love this thing? She reaches top speed too. Gotta love it. Can we do anything with this? I don't know. If you know how to get the uh, winch to work, feel free to tell me. Because I, uh, I don't know how it works. But this thing can go 5 out of 5. This thing is freaking awesome. I love it. I love all the options. You can really just make it your own. Uh, no matter how goofy you want it to look. So. Five out of five. And let's move on to our last mod over here, which is the Ram Pro Master. Oh yeah, nice. This thing has auto load. Does the doors open? Can we do this thing? Customize. We have gyro gyro fair sands. Uh, okay, so it puts a beacon on top. We don't need that. Uh, crimson. Rim. Okay, all right. Let's do white rims. Yeah. Why not? Can we open it? We can open. It. Okay, hold on. I gotta turn super strength off. I keep still getting asked how you get the little X's. That is a mod called Simple IC. You have to have the mod in order to get the X's. If you don't have the mod, you don't get the X's. That opens there. That opens. Alright, let's see. Can we get some... Let's do some wine. Let's do four perils? Pallets of wine. Uh, perils is a combination. Barrels and pallets. Alright, enable. Yeah, alright. Do they stay in there? No, alright, they just kinda... Will these go in here? I don't think so. No, okay. I guess we can... Do the lights work? Horn? Why? Why look Kukaracha? Wait, I'm sorry, do these things have daytime run lamps? It does, nice. 
We have headlights, high beams, turn signals. Turn signals all around. We have reverse lights, brake lights. All right. Yeah, I'll give it five out of five. I like it. I actually like it a lot. Um, these are getting more popular around here. So for like cargo vans, I think this is what uh, Amazon uses around here. Don't quote me on that, but yeah, I like it. So we'll give it a five out of five. And that'll do it for today's Mod Spotlight, guys. If you guys did enjoy today's Mod Spotlight, be sure to leave a like down below. It does help me out so very much, and I do appreciate it so very, very much. If you guys do want to see future Farming Simulator 22 Mod Spotlights, be sure to click that subscribe button. If you guys want to know if I whenever do go live or upload a video, click that notification bell. As always, guys, thank you so very, very much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.